Hi, this is Shahida Hill of Destination Douglasville and Maximum One Realty. I'm giving you your top three places to go in Douglasville this month. And please, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell icons for new videos every week. So let me get right into it. Number one, these are my top three, plus I'm going to give you my destination for November as well. So number one is PJs with Santa at the mall. So Arbor Place Mall is doing PJs with Santa so the children can wear their PJs, they can eat cookies, Santa's going to tell a story. It's basically um, starting the holidays off at Arbor Place Mall. So Santa will be there to take pictures and all of that as well. The first 150 children get ornaments. So that is this Saturday, November 9th at 10 a.m. So this Saturday, November 9th at 10 a.m. The details will be in the comments. Number two, Veterans Day, which is Monday. So Veterans Day, Douglasville is having a lighted Veterans Day parade. So the parade's at night, but it's lit. It's going to be beautiful. It's going to be a great um, event to take your children to really um, celebrate our veterans and people that, you know, work to protect us all year long. Um, my children will be out there. We have a my niece is, she came back from Afghanistan, now she's in Hawaii, but she's been serving in the military, plus my grandparents. So it's just a great um, opportunity for you to really honor our veterans in the Douglasville area. And it's a great activity to bring your children to. That starts, it starts at Douglas County High School, and then it'll go to downtown Douglasville. Again, 7 p.m., um, and you can get anywhere along the parade route, but 7 p.m. Veterans Day, which is Monday, November 11th. The last event is the Hunter Fest or the Harvest Fest at Hunter Park. I'm sorry, Hunter Harvest. It's an art and crafts um, fair at Hunter Park. They rescheduled this. It was um, originally scheduled for October, and then it rained. So the, the date now is November 16th. Um, they're going to have crafts and fair, um, different vendors selling things. They will have a kid, kid zone with bouncy houses. I think for the kid zone, it's $5, but everything else is free for you to see. I think if you have younger children, it's free as well for the kid zone. Um, so those are great, three great things for you to do in Douglasville this month. And I, my destination for the month of November is Lunar Golf at... Um, Arbor Place Mall. So my husband originally told me about this um, and I was kind of wary about doing golf at Arbor Place. However, my children love it. So it is Lunar Golf and it basically is a miniature golf um, course in the mall. I believe it's by Sears and across from where Payless used to be where they have the bungee jumping it's right there. It's number one, it's affordable. So you can for eight dollars, I believe, and it's, it's even less expensive for young children. But for eight dollars, you can do the course two times. And at the end of the course, you could you know possibly win the last hole. You can possibly win um, a free prize, like for a free um, when you return, like a free trip. And my daughter has won like three times these free trips. So it's not that difficult to win. But it's affordable, it's fun, children will love it. My husband and I did it as well. We had fun, it was a little competitive. But again, you can go through the course. I think it has at least, don't quote me on this, but it has at least 16 holes. So, um, and you can go through it two times. So once you're finished with it once, you can go again for the same price. They also do birthday parties. If you want to do a birthday party, just an event, I think the birthday parties are $99, which is, again, affordable. So my location for this month is Lunar Golf. It's particularly good for um, this season as it gets chilly. You don't want to, and people don't want to do that many outdoor activities. If you want to do Lunar Golf one, you know, day in the afternoon, in the evening when school gets out, it'll be a great activity for you and your family. So if you have any comments, please put it in the comments. I'll be sure to follow up with those. If you would like to reach me, all of my information is in the description as well. Thank you so much for watching. This is Shahida Hill of Maximum One Realty and Destination Douglasville, excellence in buyer, seller, and community service.